right? So there's obviously there's uh, ion trapped, right? We are um, uh, you're measuring ions and how they interact with each other. I think that's how it works. Not totally clear on that, but there's photonics, which is you're basically using particle light particles um, to to measure these uh, quantum states. There's topological qubits, which uh, Microsoft has uh, the backbone of their research. Um, and there's probably at least half a dozen more uh, and that are prom technologies that are promising. And there's probably a dozen more ways to do it, too, that we've not really heard about or that have potential in and of themselves. So the whole notion that, you know, uh, that this technology is settled or zipped up and, and wrapped in a bow, as you as you put it, is not we're not there yet. Right. And yeah. we may never get there. Right. There are certain problems that, like quantum annealing. We talked about last time where quantum annealing is good at certain types of problems, but photonics may be better at other types of problems, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So we may end up in a world where 